welcome to Zoo to You Vertebrates Edition. We are here in our Georgia Extremes building visiting some fish today. But before we get too far into what makes the fish unique, let's talk about what it means that fish are vertebrates. So a vertebrate is any animal that has a backbone or a spine. So if you put your hand in the middle of your back and lean forward a little bit until you feel some lumps and bumps running up and down the center of your back, those are your vertebra or the bones that make up your spine. Fish also have a spine or a backbone. But fish are a little unique and different from us in a couple of different ways. First of all, you and I are gonna breathe with lungs, but fish have something called gills. And those gills can open up or close, and that allows oxygen to pass into their system. They are also covered in scales. And they will have those scales their entire life fish are also going to have fins, unlike you and I, where we've got hands and fingers and toes. Fish are gonna use their fins to help propel them through the water. They've got tail fins, dorsal fins, and a myriad of other kinds, depending on what sort of fish you're looking at. Now, a true fish is probably going to lay eggs. So those eggs are gonna be gel-like, unlike a bird's egg, which is nice and hard, or a reptile egg, which is gonna be leathery. Fish eggs are gonna be almost like jello, is what they would sort of look and feel like. They're gonna lay them in the water, the fish will hatch in the water, and then they will spend their entire lives living underwater. Fish are also going to be cold-blooded. So you and I, our body temperature, we're warm-blooded creatures, so our body temperature should stay the same. But cold-blooded creatures, such as fish, use their environment to either heat up or cool down their body. If they get too hot or too cold, they know that they need to move and find another place to be so that they can balance their body temperature back out so that it stays at a healthy level. Thank you guys so much for joining us with Zoo to You today. That's all we've got as far as fish goes. But if you are looking for more at-home learning resources, please feel free to check out the Learn page at zooatlanta.org or stay connected with us on social media using the hashtag OnlyZooATL.